All right, guys, welcome back to the road to SSL in 3v3. Today is episode number 13 of the series, and today we're going to be Turbo Salsa. So thank you so much to Melodic Journey for this recommendation. Let me know in the comments what you guys want to see next. I'm loving all the comments and recommendations so far. I'm picking the most liked ones, of course. This one's not the most liked, but I, it's too good not to do. So let's make this photo real quick and then get into the episode. All right, so no pun intended, but this one's a bit of a tall order. So we're going to be grabbing a picture of Turbo Pulsa. I already like this first one, which is why I have it selected right here. So I'm going to drop this in Photoshop and then grab some salsa. This one looks pretty good. I think it'll fit well with the, the theme. So we'll grab this one real quick and then drop that in. And the last thing on the list, and probably honestly the hardest part of this, is going to be making a chip with salsa coming out of the guy with the microphone from that photo. So I'm going to probably grab this one. I was looking at some of these. There's eyeballs on this for some reason. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to grab this one and then rotate the hand and try to cover the microphone as good as possible. It's not great. I'm going to try and widen it a little bit. All right, not horrible, not horrible. Let me try to shift that a little bit. And I need to add a new chip. All right, we got the, the hand in the right place. And we're gonna do a little bit of movie magic and uh, block the chip in the background. Go back to this layer. And we're going to quickly delete the little thumb area. <laughs> I'm spending way too long on this photo. All right, let's bring that salsa back real quick. Gotta bring it above. Oh my gosh, it's perfect. One last thing. <laughs> Oh my god, it's a masterpiece. All right, and there we have it. I spent a little bit longer on that photo than I'd care to admit, but in the last episode, we ended up at Champion 2, Grand Champion 2, Division 3 in 1654 MMR. So we're already getting pretty close to Grand Champion th uh, 3, which would be the second highest rank, and we're super, super close to SSL. So far, we haven't lost a game in the series yet, but we're getting into some pretty tough matches in the last couple episodes. If you haven't seen them all, uh, they're in a playlist if you want to follow along. But we've been in some pretty sweaty overtimes, but so far we've come through uh, scot-free. But hopefully in this episode we can continue that streak. But if you are enjoying the daily episodes and variety of content on the channel, I'm trying to keep it fresh every day for you guys. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. It helps me out a ton. And we're currently on the road to 2 million subscribers, so hopefully we can make it there quite soon. We're a bit of a ways away, obviously. But now let's get to the next episode. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, we got the very first game of the day for me and the episode, and uh, Turbo Salsa is looking pretty juicy. And for today, we've actually got uh, a nice little bottle of liquid confidence. And I'm not talking about the the, the type you're thinking of. I finally put Alpha Boost on this on on this uh, on this account uh, through Brock's mod. I realized for the entire series so far, we have not used it. This guy's up super early, might beat me here. Well played from him. I like that uh, wild try to leave that boost. Didn't work out because uh, my teammate got bumped with that guy but they ended up not taking it so it was good for us good try with a double you clear should be mid for my teammate good shot probably clear from the side i'm just watching back because in, ca in case they get any big booms Let's see if he gets a touch pop this middle hopefully my teammate can go let's go wadi nice play off the backboard good try on the double could be mid here i'm gonna watch from, for the mid pass good try from the block too going pro he says let's see it i gotta do gotta, gotta do a little better than that <laughs> See if I can stay with this. It's a good fake. Good demo, though. Like the attempt. I'm going to try and bump this guy because I got bumped forward. Take the corner as well. Good first touch. Good bump, though, as well. Good follow up. Oh, big flicks. Close. Someone could be there for the shot, maybe. Great shot. If he touched off the backboard, coming good. He ended up missing, so now I'm going to back off. Once I clear the ball down the field like this for me, I can immediately take some space. Oh, it's close. Got to try to demo me, so I was a little bit worried about that. Works out, though. Good play. Try to shoot that. Try and slot it top left. Good good block, though. Good block again. See if Wild can get in there. My teammate's up, so I'm going to back off. I'd rather, I'd rather not commit, double commit with him. So I'm just going to make sure I just back off. It's hard, it's hard in solo queue, as always, to be uh, to be sure of what your teammates are going to do. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to happen in solo queue. That's why, like I said, if you really want to rank up, I highly suggest that you uh, you queue up with people. That was actually pretty open. Probably going to score that. It's fine. It's over one. It's two. Good double, but hopefully, uh, I think it's wild goes for this. Pop this middle. One guy backflipped. He's kind of panicking in the back corner here, so let's see if they make a clear cross. Oh. Good try. Good possession from Wadi. 
it's decent that he throws it out like that. Because I think if my teammate goes pretty fast, he could be pretty good here. And if this guy misses... Oh, this could be in. No! Score that! Oh, he's nuts. <laughs> that, that was probably the worst bounce that we could have had off that corner. Really good read from Wild, though. That bounce just, like, absolutely destroyed me. I thought it was going to bounce up. Well played from him. He's defending. Yeah, left goes, as always. Good. It's a good 50-50 for my team as well, because my teammate should be there before the opponents. Yeah, they didn't even grab the mid boost either. And it's, it's in? Okay. Just like that. We've been playing for about like three and a half minutes, and then we just get another goal right off the bat. Really good first touch. I think it was Mastermind off the wall. Wasn't really quite ready, and there was someone challenging in midfield, but that guy's just trying to force something. So it's really a Mastermind to be ready off that, and I think because he didn't grab that mid boost, he was actually stuck in an awkward spot. Good bump. Two players up. Good. Oh my goodness. And there we go. <laughs> Turbo Salsa striking. You know, a little bit of a poo goal there, but a uh, really good touch from Dwadi. And he tried to go for the double. Nice flip reset. And uh, the little fake fake uh, shot to the right actually threw off that last uh, defender. Sometimes uh, changing out the speed of the shot is really important for when someone's going to pre-jump or like pre-fly across the net. This could probably be Mastermind's touch here. Go for my teammate. It's decent. It's going to be a touch from nobody. <laughs> Get it? Oh, no one was mid there. I thought maybe Wild would be ready. It's good of him to back off, though. He, he was third man, so it's not the end of the world. And we're up three goals, too. We don't have to force anything. Awkward for Mastermind. Could be a shot. Well played from Wadi as well. Honestly, pretty solid squad here. Uh, there's a few openings that I could have had at the beginning, but we're still warming up. We're looking pretty good. Teammates are really covering the field pretty well. I like the pre-flip as well. So we'll, we'll, we'll still hold on to the, the lead here. we still got, you know, only 40 seconds left. I don't think anything, anything's really going to happen that monumental that we will lose this game. <laughs> uh, as I was saying, I don't think... There's no there's no way that we're losing this game, right? Get a shot towards. Nobody's got very low boost. This guy's confusing me, man. I say nobody and it's like... I mean the guy, but it sounds like nobody. Thought my teammate might go for that, so I wasn't going to go immediately off that backward read. Good boost grab for my teammate. And with 14 seconds left, three goals to make for them. I'm thinking that's going to be it for us. See if we can get a pre-jump, maybe? Oh! Close. Teammates are all pre-jumping, too. Oh! And it's still one second left. We got we to gotta go through one more kickoff. That's all right, though. Pretty solid squad. Pretty solid game as well. Um, and this should give us enough points, hopefully, to rank up to Grand Champion th uh, Division 3. Uh, Grand Champion 2 Division 3. We were Division... Oh, we were already Division 3, right? Uh, I don't, honestly, I don't even know. Oh. This guy won. Okay. <laughs> okay. I, I like the bump. You know, I mean, we only had one second left. I wasn't too worried. The fact that that was 4-0 and then in the last 30 seconds went to 4-3. Pretty funny, but... Looking pretty good. Five shots on goal. A little bit of a assist there, but otherwise we just played a solid role. Um, didn't do too much, which is kind of what I want to do in this series, and I don't think I've done that well for the last couple episodes. But uh, yeah, we're Division 3 still. Uh, I thought we were in Division 2, but yeah, we're Division 3. Probably going to be Division 4 after this episode. Possibly Grand Champion 3. Maybe not, though. All right, game number two. We actually have a, a nemesis here, Wild MC. Oh, they were together. I didn't even realize they were partied. So yeah, we basically just swapped sides. So we'll see how we do against the team that just beat us. Great first shot from my teammate. Is is it Diaper Dan? <laughs> what a name, man. This is the kind of stuff you don't see. This is the content I don't see uh, in SSL. You know, we got all the tryhard names. We got Almost Magic Mike and Diaper Dan. It's perfect. I'm going to go back right here, see what happens off the kickoff. Good positioning. Probably going to be a clear from Wadi. See him go up early, so I'm just going to go for the 50. Diaper Dan should go for this. Maybe pinch with him. Nice. It'll be awkward for Wild, but my teammate should be able to cover the right side. It's a good pass. Lots of space. I see all this space, so I'm just going to wait, wait for him to pre-jump and then go around him. Go around him again. Could be in. Close. Two players in mid. The other guy got demoed, so there's lots of space for my teammate to grab the ball. Try to get mid for him. Not the greatest second touch. That's still lots of space. Bit of a throwaway from my teammate. And uh, I see that guy turning away, so there's no one really on the ball. Big boom around Wadi. Ends up throwing the ball away as well. Make them waste the boost. Good try from Diaper Dan. Oh, okay. Touch us around him. Keep it clear to the corner. I'm going to watch midfield here. To my teammate. Get it clear as well. I'll stay with this. Make sure I keep it soft with the touch. Try to keep it, but Diaper Dan should have a free touch. Well played. 
try and bump Wadi here if I can, which is good. The guy got stole the boost. Uh, the hunter boost is now worthless since he stole it. So it kind of balances out the resources. Good fakes. Oh, okay, okay. Camera just freaked out. Good touch. I hate when my camera does that. Does that happen to anybody anybody else? Where it just does the wrong spin? It just like turns the other way. Decent touch, but he's kind of spilled it mid. Uh, for, for our team. Ends up missing two. None of my teammates were ready for that miss though. I, I don't blame Diaper Dan for that because he was trying to read the clear to the right. And our third was pretty far out of the game. If anything, it's probably our third's position. But since he was in the back corner, you can't really expect him to be there. I am last here, so I gotta go immediately on this. Let's stay close. Get a 50. Two players out. Your last is up. I see Ty is going for a bump maybe. I like the, the relieving pressure there. Good fake from Magic Mike. Could be a shot. Try double here. Should be alright. Make sure I get a soft touch to the sidewall so I can still recoil my ball. Uh, the ball off my car in a position where it's decent for me to follow up. Get a solid clear down the field too in wild. Gonna pass it down to me. See if uh, Diaper Dan follows this after this touch. Mid. I'm gonna beat him instead of going for the shot on target. Hopefully Magic Mike can follow this as well. If I went for target, it would have been a clear and a 50-50. That would have been awkward for my team. So instead I get a very clean win. And that way, it's harder for the opponents to read. It's going to be awkward for them. Could pop this one more time. Close. They're going to get that corner. I already know that. So I'm going to immediately move out of the way. Try to get the mid. Which I'm not sure why I was gone. But wow. That was a really awkward play there. I didn't expect them to chip it so fast. But we read it pretty well. Wait for Wadi here. Bit of a miss. Wait for Ty to maybe go. Oh, okay. Okay. Decent. No boost. Back corner should be there. Actually, mid was there as well. He just spawned. All right. Wait for his touch. And there we go. Pretty solid game. Um, obviously, we just held our ground again. We're not doing too too much of a crazy thing to uh, you know stand out amongst the other players. We're just kind of playing our game and, and staying in a good position amongst uh, our teammates' rotations and stuff. And with solo queue teammates like that, it was actually pretty solid. Um, I think that Wild and Wadi did a pretty good job on my team. Um, but against me, obviously, it wasn't as strong. They did look pretty consistent, but most of the time we were just holding that midfield and uh, just watching for our teammates to rotate in position. And like I said, focusing on those shots on target when you need to. And when there's too many players covering the, 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 the bases in defense, try to put, the, put it around them uh, to a teammate or, you know, into open space for your teammates to fall up in the future. And we got the same party squad, and they're back on our team again. So let's see how we do. Diaper Dan's on the other team. A lot of a lot of nemesis uh, in this episode. Wadi's gonna be low boost here, and with Wild jumping up for this, I gotta be a little bit stained, a uh, little bit careful of this touch, because both my teammates are gonna be pretty low. Teammate going could be dangerous as well. I'm not gonna be able to get that. Um, I, I'm not a big fan of my teammate clearing it like that because it's gonna be open to open space. Um, I didn't wasn't sure if Wadi would be there, and Wild taking a super long rotation there is gonna be awkward as well. Try to get back down to the floor, but there's almost no way that I can recover with that after I land on the wall the way I did. But we got we to gotta recover a goal now. Not the end of the world. Not a big fan of that touch either. He could have held onto it, but he instead gives it to Jackal. Should stay with this. My teammate went forward for the demos, so we're, we're now second and third man. Not a big fan of that either. I don't know what happened from the first game. We were looking pretty solid as a squad, but this is a little, little nerve-wracking. I'm not going to lie. It's going to be Jackal first. It's going to be a beat there. Go for the back corner. Good touch. Zero's probably going to clear it to us. So I'm going to stay with this instead. See if Wadi can make a touch. Not great. See if my teammate can go in the way. Pop it up mid. Not great either, but good follow up. It's a big whiff from the opponents. Good 50 50 from the opponent off that defense as well. To be a turn from Wadi immediately. There we go. It was a little bit slow, but he could have uh, uh, could have been more dangerous. Big ball chasey turn from the opponents. Keeping pressure, bumping Jackal out as well. Hopefully, Wadi can get a 50-50. If not, now Wild can get a clear. Decent touch. Let's see what Zero does. Really awkward for him. Good 50. And it's in. <laughs> okay, just like that. I just realized he's also using the goal explosion I used to use uh, after opening the tournament crates. I got the titanium white. I'm not sure if uh, the tournament crates are... Oh, it's, it's actually gray, I think. 
I'm not sure if they're guaranteed the same order every time. Uh, like, like, uh, the rocket pass is now, but either way. Good. Not a great touch, but to be able to follow it. See if Wadi can make a touch. Wait for him instead. Ooh, that was awkward. To be Wild Mike's touch. Pop it up. So these two like to follow up each other's touches. So be a little bit careful with that. Um, I don't really want to mess with the two of them. Get touch on the corner. Wait for Wild Mike's free touch. It's better that I rotate behind him and let my teammate get an, uh, a free touch. Big misses. Soft touch this to the side so it stays to the corner. Pop it around the one and maybe get a 50-50 here. That way it's two players committed for the price of one. Big misses, but it's still open. Hopefully Wild Mike can shoot it. Just strong enough, and there we go. So that double was really well, uh, really good for us. Two players were taken out of the game. It was bound to be a good chance for us as long as uh, my teammates were ready for it. And because I got that 50-50 with that first touch, uh, I kind of got a third man assist there. But uh, that's 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 the situation where you know I've, I've basically taken out two players for the price of one, and that's immediately going to give us an advantage. I'm gonna fake this. Give a good shot. Good save. I wasn't in a great position to be a teammate. Oh, what a dunk. That's going to be, that's gonna be in now. My teammate did, so took a really wide rotation. It was a bit awkward off that play. Uh, right here, this touch. I would have liked him to go around the player to the, the right corner, which is what I thought was going to happen. He tried to get the, the clear, which was a greedy play, because they still have a good chance at defending the ball or defending the clear. So you got to make sure you uh, pay attention to those situations and try to just play around them, like I said. It's the best situation for the team. Oh, man. I did not expect that. When you're when you're first man challenging on the defense, you want to make sure that you play the ball um, and not uh, not play the fake because your teammates can cover that. Decent try. Both of them missed. Wadi could go for a shot. Would have liked to pass here um, or a high shot. Either one would have been good. It's not a great touch. I can't follow that because zero should be there. I'm trying to throw the ball away. Decent touch as well. Good. Clear it off the sidewall. Maybe I can follow this up. They don't expect it. Didn't have enough boost. My teammate did go though, and Chat Mike, uh, oh Wild Mike, might be able to take a shot here. Good defense. Oh, not the greatest touch. We're probably gonna kill it here. Probably got overtime. Solid, solid game so far. A little bit awkward at times, but it's all good. Get a big booming clear. Wadi's trying for it. Let's go. And you got the read too. What the heck? Oh my goodness. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Careful of Jackal here off the touch. Give me a clear of the corner. I didn't really like where my teammate was going to probably hit the ball to. So instead, I go for the touch. Oh my. Okay, stay with this. Hopefully, he dribbles. Well played. Not a big fan of that touch either. Get over me here. Hopefully, Wadi can make it clear. He does. Well played. Jackal's going to have an awkward bounce here. He ends up missing. And it's in the net. <laughs> Spicy, just like the turbo salsa. Uh, what a finish to this episode. Uh, is actually looking pretty pretty scarce of a chance there. I was actually a little worried, but we made it work. We got the overtime goal because of a big whiff from Jackal. And uh, overall, not a bad uh, episode for the series. Let's see if we get Grand Champion Division or Grand Champion 2 Division. Oh, yeah, we're already Division 4. What happened? Did we, did we promote last game? I don't even know what's happening anymore. <laughs> Well, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Make sure to subscribe, like I said, if you haven't already. It helps me out a ton. And until next time, have a great day, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.